if it's one thing I can't stand are liars and false witnesses. Not only do you make me look bad, but you make yourself look foolish and you put others in jeopardizing positions that they never needed to be in in the first place. We need to do away with you. Peace, blessings, glory, praise, and honor to the most high. If you want to lie, if you want to put out false information, instigate gossip, spread rumors, promote and advertise the wrong information, that's your choice. I get humans. We're greedy. We want and desire. We step on anything and everyone to get exactly what we want, even if it means destroying friendships, destroying relationships, costing people their livelihood. We go to the ends of the earth for attention, for validation, for finances for desires of our own heart we are just some of the most vicious creatures and creations ever known in the history of biblical proportions you will get on the internet edit crop filter copy paste Photoshop information to fit into various clippings of interviews and shows that have absolutely nothing to do with a person's personal life, all so that you can get a few clicks and likes on it. You will lie on your friends and on your loved ones because of envy and jealousy, because you wish you were in a position that they were in, thinking that, oh, if I sabotage them and I just gently sprinkle on a little bit of false information, it won't hurt too bad. I can get them out of the way and I can take over their position. <coughs> the history shows that people are either dead or in jail or in a repeated cycle of pain, misery, anger, bitterness, hurt, frustration, constantly stalking, stabbing, fighting, getting locked up, stalking, stalking, more stalking, drama, If you want to do that, if that's the type of person you want to be, we can't stop you. I can't stop you. And this goes from the higher ups to all the way down to the little people in the suburban areas and the small little buildings with the corner offices. It, it, it goes to them, too. No one is exempt. A lot of us are in this position even as we speak, and I often wonder why. Is it that worth it? Is getting the, 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 the first million views on this story worth it, even if it's at the risk of putting out false narratives that could make the other person involved in that story 
look a certain way that they shouldn't be painted in all because you just were so desperate to have a hundred million people subscribe and watch and comment on your stuff. Is it really that worth it? You're destroying people and putting bad juju on, on folks that didn't deserve it. Nasty bitch. All of you trifling. And you really don't understand. And, and for real, for real, I'm stuttering a little bit because it's like, it's really, really exacerbating how even as an adult, you don't understand the repercussions behind your actions. What goes into putting all that energy into lying and scripting and making up and falsifying and plagiarizing all of that, all of this to get something that wasn't even for you in the first place. You, you go out your way to sabotage people's success, their, their families, all that. Getting people arrested, getting people unalived, getting people beat up, assaulted, verbally harassed on the internet harassed at work harassed and harassed and the more you do you do all of this because you want this woman you want that guy or you want that promotion or you want those views or you want that like or you want that subscription or you want this person to like you a little bit more or you want to impress somebody people really really be that low in self-esteem that envious to go to all of these limits and what has it really gotten you it hasn't gotten you me or anyone anywhere that far don't you think that your strategy should switch up just a little bit you spend all that time directing it towards something that clearly isn't yours when you could do and redirect that to something that might be a better fit for you did you ever think about that Oh, Jesus help us. Jesus help us. I came across a story that was talking about a triangle of um, a man, a woman, and another woman that was going through some envy and jealousy because he was sleeping with somebody and she was jealous of the person. It's a bunch of bull. The bottom line is the platform that posted the story they doctored it and really didn't give full context to us so the people in the comment section are pissed and bewildered trying to figure out why something's not right here this something's not adding up and then there was a particular post that said man y'all need to stop with this shit because this is not what happened and you lied and you're you need to put out the right information and then like often i see this all the time people are doing this constantly putting out stuff without knowing the truth or just like why 